Welcome to the Bureau's long range forecast for April to June 2024. An increased chance of unusually high temperatures for this time of year is likely for parts of the country. But first, let's look at recent conditions. March 2024 rainfall was above average across much of northern and inland Australia, leading to flooding in some areas following ex-tropical cyclone Megan and an active monsoon trough. Record high daily rainfall totals were recorded in parts of the Northern Territory, including Borroloola, MacArthur River Mine and Tennant Creek. Rainfall is on track to be in the top five highest on record for March for Western Australia and the Northern Territory. In contrast, parts of the South had below average rainfall, with rainfall in Victoria on track to be in the 10 lowest on record for March. Maximum temperatures for March were above average across the southeast and in parts of Queensland and the West Australian coast. Due to persistent cloud and rainfall, maximum temperatures were below average in large parts of Western Australia and the Northern Territory. Minimum temperatures for March are on track to be in the top three warmest on record. Queensland and South Australia are on track to have their warmest March minimum temperatures since records began in 1910. Soil moisture this month has been above average across large areas of the North and West, but below average in the Southeast, especially in Tasmania. Australia's total water storages are around 79% full. Storages in the Victorian Southeast Coast, Murray-Darling Basin and South West Coast are around 10% lower than at the same time last year. Let's look at the long range forecast for April to June. There is roughly an equal chance of above and below median rainfall in most of Queensland, northern and eastern New South Wales, southern Tasmania and parts of the west. The rest of Australia has an increased chance of below median rainfall. However, the chances of unusually low rainfall is below 50% for all areas except the northwest. Near median to high stream flows are likely for most forecast locations between March and May. Turning to temperatures, there is a high chance of above median maximum temperatures across most of Australia. We're heading into the cooler months, but the forecast shows an increased chance of unusually high maximum temperatures, particularly in Western Australia, which also has an increased chance of unusually high minimum temperatures. Tasmania and areas of the East Coast are also forecast to have unusually high minimum temperatures for this time of year. Let's look at some of the recent influences on our climate. Global sea surface temperatures remain high, with March 2024 on track to be the warmest March on record. Closer to home, sea surface temperatures off the east coast of Australia, from the Coral to the Tasman Seas, are warmer than average. They are forecast to remain above average from April to June. El Nino is near its end. We expect conditions to return to neutral in the Pacific Ocean later in autumn. Follow the long range forecast on the Bureau's website. We update this forecast regularly and the forecast changes as it gets closer to the coming months. You can also select your location on the maps to see more details for your area. In summary, the April to June forecast shows roughly an equal chance of above and below median rainfall in parts of New South Wales, Queensland, Tasmania and Western Australia, below median rainfall likely elsewhere an increased chance of unusually high temperatures for this time of year, near median to high stream flows likely at most locations. You can find out more about the long range forecast on the Bureau's website. We'll see you next time.